One thing that musicians rarely talk about is uh, nerves. And um, I never struggled with nerves when I was young. I loved being on stage and I never understood what what the problem was, why, why I get nervous and that I love doing this and it's natural. And Until a certain age, at about 15, 16, I started getting very, very nervous. And to the point that, especially when I was playing with, with orchestra, I would play worse in the concert than I would in any other part of the, of the process. And I started doubting whether I'm made for this because surely if I can't do the concert well, then I, this, isn't my, this isn't for me. And I found very little advice from people about that because often teachers aren't really performers anymore. Or maybe some of them weren't primarily performers under high pressure sort of situations. And musicians, especially when they're younger, they don't like to share that so much. So I had to, I tried all kinds of things, all kinds of techniques to deal with nerves. And I can say now, luckily, that I, I mean, I'm not, I don't say that I don't get nervous anymore, but it's very rarely influences me in a negative way now. I can channel it in a way that adds to the performance. But it's taken me a long time, and it's a con continuous uh, process. And I grew up with, with musicians, excellent musicians, who basically gave up on a performing career because they thought they were nervous, and that other people aren't, and that obviously that's not for them, and they, they didn't pursue uh, I don't know, cures. And it should be really regarded as something like a, like any other problem. It's a problem or an, an issue that you have, like with a bow change or with your vibrato or something, that can be solved. Nobody is, maybe some people are born without the, the problem of getting nervous, but very few. And almost everybody has found a way to deal with it. And I just think whatever it takes, just try all kinds of different you know, mental, physical, um, rethinking the meaning of concerts, not thinking of concerts as a challenge or as a test and asking yourself, why do people go to concerts and don't they want to enjoy it and are they there to judge or you find out that no, they're not. They're there because they want to enjoy music and they love music and they want it to be as good as possible. Um, and breathing in the right way and sleeping at the right time and there are lots of things that add to that and everybody has to find their own um, solution and um, just know that it's it's curable and it's it's not easy for anybody